Vincent, it took you guys a couple periods tonight to kind of get you know your legs under you and get going. But happy with the way you guys controlled the pace in the uh, third period and able to get the win here tonight. Yeah, totally. Obviously, anytime you can get a win, you're going to be a happy bunch. Um, yeah, like you kind of mentioned, I didn't think our start was that great. Laval, um, they have a bunch of guys on their team who are going to work hard. So I think that it's always going to make it hard on us. But, um, yeah, we were kind of happy with our response there. Sparks, you had a great game. It was obviously great to get the win. Is that something you guys can expect after playing a team, you know, like Belleville, another example, and the Val sort of starting the game in a bit of a lull and sort of taking some time to, to get things going? Um, not necessarily. I mean, all these teams in this league are good. Everyone's competing for something. Everyone's trying to prove something. Um, so every game's going to be competitive. And if you don't come out and play, you're going to be on the wrong side of most of those games. So, um, so yeah, I thought we came out a little sluggish to start, but as the game progressed, I thought we got better and better. You've got a big challenge coming up later this week in taking on Manitoba. Is that something you guys are looking forward to? Yeah, I think so. Obviously, they're, um, they're a team that's top in the standings in the Central. So, um, you know, it's a game that we kind of, I think we're kind of looking forward to. It's, uh, it's going to be some good competition, so we're excited for it. Being a veteran for this team, you know, at 28 years old, is it kind of a lot different now than compared to when you just came to the league with Manchester? Uh, yeah, I mean, the league's a lot different in a lot of ways, but... Um, League's a lot different, but it's still more or less the same. Um, you know, you still have guys coming up every single year that are great players. Um, but yeah, there's definitely been some changes compared to when I first came out. When you have these kind of practices stacked with players, that must be pretty good for development of all you guys to have such high intensity practices. Do you think that's kind of paid off throughout the year? Uh, totally. I mean, anytime there's good competition, I think it brings out the best in a lot of people. So uh, I think, you know, bringing these guys in and provide some competition, I think guys, uh, I think everyone kind of benefits from it. What has your impression been of, of some of these young guys, Zhang Ball, Ferguson, Ploof, a lot um, of faces? Like yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's tough to say. I've seen them play one game, and, you know, there's nerves there's and whatnot. So I think they all did they all did great in their debuts. Uh, I know Kessner had a goal. I think Ploof had a couple points. Ferguson looked good. Um, so, and obviously Engvall had a couple goals in back-to-back -back games. So it's, you know, it's hard to say because your first game you get some nerves. You're not sure. But uh, I thought they've all looked good. They all compete in practice, and uh, that's all you can really ask for. March has been a huge munch for you personally, at least score sheet-wise. How important is it for you to sort of be at the top of your game heading into the playoffs? Yeah, I mean, I think that's huge. I mean, you, you always want to be playing your best hockey going into, going into playoffs, and that's something I've kind of – prided myself on over the years is playing my best hockey when uh, during the playoffs so um, it's good to kind of get things rolling and uh, playing good personally and as a team right before playoffs get here. Have any of the younger guys gravitated towards you as a veteran on the team like any of the new guys coming in? Um, you'd have to ask them um, <laughs> so um, yeah I mean I'd like to think of my guys like, I like to think of myself as a person who can, like, pretty easy to talk to, able to talk to a lot of these guys. Um, but, yeah, you'd have to ask those guys. I don't know. What have you seen about the progression of Trevor Moore? He's someone that's starting to be a big contributor for you guys in 2018. What have you seen in his progression? Um, yeah, I think he's gotten better as uh, the season's gone along. Um, he's a great skater. He's good on his edges. I don't want to give him too much praise because he's standing right over there. But, um, <laughs> no, I, I think he's been great. I mean, he's a great skater, um, good college boy, which we always like. Um, so, yeah, he's been great the whole entire year.